guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Dean, and today we're watching episode number three of Parasite. This one is called Feast. So I'm um, two episodes in. I'm really enjoying this show, man. It's creepy and weird and gorgeously animated, and I'm liking the story. It's uh, it's really interesting to me. So in episode two last week, Demon in the Flesh, uh, Shinichi uh, met a another parasite. He Promptly, well, Miji, he, his, right, his right arm, the, the little parasite guy that's driving his arm, uh, sliced and diced that other parasite up real nice. And um, yeah, I love how brutal this can get and how weird and, and strange. It's, it's awesome. And Shinichi's also got a, a potential new girlfriend. So yeah, it's all, it's all sunshine and roses in this show, I'm sure. It's going to be nothing but romance and um, prancing through the fields of horror and death. So anyway, let's just dive into the, the show. Uh, Patreon people, full time reaction, YouTube highlighted highlighted version. Alright, and also I got all my links for my socials down below as well, including Patreon and Discord and TikTok and everything else. Come say hi. Alright, are we ready? Feast. Oh shit, this could be bad. We're gonna get more mincemeat motors. People turned into hamburgers. You wearing the grey coat? Somebody's talking out loud? Oh shit, she's calling out a molester. She's got that, that look in her eyes. Kicked his ass. Okay, I don't know who who's gonna be a parasite and, and not. I'm assuming she is, but she didn't kill the dude. She just threw him off the train, and quite rightly so. Yes, so I like her. So obviously she noticed him doing the the touching, but I'm finding the and so far like it's literally my third episode, but. The people who who have been taken over by the parasites, their eyes are just a little bit out of focus. Yeah, there she is. She, she's in the credits. She's in the credits. Wait, was she one of the... Was she the one talking to the other dude in the last episode and they started fornicating to make more parasites? It's been a week since my last step. I, I don't remember. Well, not a week, four days. I just had the weekend. I didn't do any recording on the weekend. So, it's been four days. How come he's not wearing his glasses anymore in that in that bit? Does his vision get better? 84 people. <laughs> So he can sense another parasite close by. Is it going to be the mincemeat murderer? Oh, it's the school. Oh shit, that's another student. A teacher? Of course, the other one can sense him as well. A new math, a new math teacher. It's a new teacher. Case closed. It's the teacher. Oh, it's her. Here we go. Spotted. Don't look. She's up the front. Okay. So she's just gonna go out for like random killing sprees every now and then when she's hungry? I bet the guy on the train's gonna get tracked down. The molester. She's gonna hunt him down and eat him. And here she comes. Hi. Hot teacher wants to talk to you. Oh, there's always a horn dog. <laughs> always one. 
あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ、そうです。あ
the fuck? It ended. <laughs> Is it? Oh my god, that was 20 minutes. I had no, no concept of time. Okay. It's an interesting name for uh, an episode. Um, paranoid, Sinichi attends a school-wide assembly where the staff introduce a beautiful new teacher. And, um, yeah, she's obviously going to be the one to... Well, I think they're going to join forces. I think um, in the next episode, the fight is obviously going to begin between A, Shinichi, and, and Migi. Migi? Miji? And her... What's her name? What's her name? Ryoko, right? Ryoko. I think she's going to... Um, well, she's... Migi said she was going to observe the fight. Like, she was 150 metres away. She was going to watch the fight. Maybe she just wants to see how he, how he goes. But if he starts to lose, maybe she'll join in and help. I don't know. I'm sensing she's going to be some kind of an ally at the moment. I mean, she seems pretty rational about, you know, not just willy-nilly killing people, maintaining her identity, doing the right thing. So I think she's going to be friendly, but I could be wrong. I mean, parasites are essentially insects. They will do what they want when they want. They will just chop you to bits if they, if they feel like it. I mean, we have got mincemeat murders going on. So I found it interesting that they, they had sex and it's just going to result in a normal human baby. So the parasitic nature of uh, the possession, it doesn't really change the, the human anatomy or the physiology in any way when it comes to reproduction. So two parasites having sex is not going to give birth to a baby parasite like I assumed last week. So interesting. So they're, they're not, how are they going to reproduce? How do they reproduce? Can you just cut off a, a hand, right? And then that hand will go, grow into another parasite, like a carbon copy of yourself? I don't know. I need to watch more of the show. So I am done. Thank you for stopping by and checking out my reaction. Don't forget to check out all my links down below for all my socials. Subscribe, leave a like, and I'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.